he thought with a kind of astonishment of the biological uselessness of pain and fear. The treachery of the human body, which always freezes into inertia at exactly the moment when a special effort is needed. It struck him that in moments of crisis, one is never fighting against an external enemy, but always against one's own body. And it is the same, he perceived, in all seemingly heroic or tragic situations, on the battlefield, in the torture chamber, on a sinking ship. The issues that you are fighting for are always forgotten, because the body swells up until it fills the universe. And even when you are not paralyzed by fright or screaming with pain, life is a moment-to-moment -moment struggle against hunger or cold or sleeplessness, against a sour stomach or an aching tooth.